Hello, Career Education, and welcome to day 103. 103, 103. Today. I haven't sang the number yet. Oh. You weren't here yesterday. I had things to do, people to Whoa. see. What happened? Oh, it might be my favorite episode. I'm sorry. And I missed it? Yeah, definitely oh go back and watch it. Oh, it's with Sam. Yeah. Oh. That was mean. That was mean. Oh, it was so fun. I'm glad it didn't throw up. Anyway. You wouldn't have let me do that to you. No, I would not. <laughs> Today's day 103, which means it is Thursday. Yeah. And Thursday, as everybody knows, when it's day 103 on a Thursday is a holiday. Do you know the holiday? Yeah. Yeah. I do. It is color TV day. Color TV day, and I see you're celebrating. With oh, Richard. yeah! Now, um, we haven't rehearsed this, and I love putting Andrew on the spot. Let's see how many of them you can name in 10 seconds. Go. Um, Mr. Crab, SpongeBob, Hey Arnold, Phil and Lil, Liza Thornberry, Angelica, Ren and Stimpy. Oh, I don't know the monster Time's people. Up. Okay. I don't know how many you got. You have to check the video. Yeah. <laughs> that was fun. So, which, yeah. uh, which of these did you watch growing up? Oh, I really liked Hey Arnold. I like Tay Arnold too, but I can't tell you anything that I remember from it. But I watched it. He's a football head. Yeah, but tell me a plot of one episode. A plot of one. Exactly. I, it's such a forgettable that, show. Well, there's one, the movie that had to save the neighborhood. Okay, so. I'll give you that. Yeah. Um, the Rugrats, they yeah. were always just getting into Classic. trouble. Classic. Yep. Uh, but yeah. W were you scared of Angelica? A little bit. Yeah, she was she, she, to be too. She was mean. So, you know, back before there was color TV, yeah, like it was only in black and white. Which is weird. Which is weird, because like, imagine this. That would be such a black and white. Hey, boring watch, backdrop. Watch this. Black and white. Fix it! <laughs> That'll be fun. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, you know, I thought color TV, I used to watch some old shows. Okay. That actually, there was one of the shows that I watched in black and white. In black and white. Was and it even worth watching? Yes, it was great. Okay. It was great. Um, I wanted to name a couple of my favorite TV shows growing up, and I want you to name some of yours. And mine aren't in black and white. Well, some. Of them. Well, I have some. Mm, definitely. Well, that's okay. We can still talk about what we like to watch. Okay. All right, you go first. Um, I would say all-time favorite classic was Boy Meets World. Oh, that's a great, great um, show. My name's Corey, and his uh, name's Corey. He was the main character. Yeah. And like a true confession, I had a poster of Topanga in my room. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was awkward. Yeah. <laughs> what about you? Um, I so black and white. I, I've already thought about this. Uh -huh. I liked Andy Griffith show. I don't know if I've ever seen one episode. Um, I'll have to watch it. It's yeah. got a fun whistle. It's good. It's Mulberry Man. Mayberry. Oh, Mulberry. Mayberry. Same thing. Um, then, so cartoon, you know, I like the shirt, mm -hmm. but even the cartoon that I, one of favorite cartoons growing up was Popeye the Sailor Man. How old are you? Well, I would watch it with my dad. Okay. We had, was, and it, a lot of those were in black and white, some of them are in color. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, good shows. But, you know, one thing I thought about with the color TV thing, you know, you have, like, Andy Griffith show, it's a great show, but you could never see, like, they would... It would always seem to be like springtime there, and you all the colors are missing. So you Seven. didn't know like what season it was. Yeah, it was kind of weird. They could have all been wearing yellow shirts. Yeah, they how could. weird would that have been? And you didn't even know. Yeah, what if like so you think that his uniform? He's a police officer, he's uh -huh. a sheriff. What like what if it was pink? I think we would purple. never know. He probably wore a pink and purple uniform. Probably did. That's weird to think about. They, it looked like this, but you didn't even know what it really was. Right. But, you know, we based on what we know and we see around us, mm -hmm. I was like, when I see a tree on that show, oh, that's green. It's probably a green tree. Or, you know, when I see a lake, it's got like that, you know, like most ponds around here have that like brown tint yeah. to it. And grass is green. It's not gray. We don't have gray grass. I particularly like blue lakes. The brown lakes. Well, yeah, I mean, just saying. the thought of a blue lake sounds a lot better, but most okay. of them are brown. I'm, I'm tracking along. Yeah. And so I like, there's what's real, like <laughs> what we really know to be true about color. And then. Based on what we've seen. Based on what we've seen. And, but then we look at the TV show and we're like, wait, that's not. 
That's not what it really looks like. And Andrew, I've been playing along and watching at home, so I know exactly where you're going with this. Yeah? It where am I has going? to do with our word for the month, which is? Faith. And faith is being sure of what we hope for. And sure of what we do not see. And we see in color. So you can look at what you look at around your house. You'd see those green yeah, trees yeah. and you know that black and white, it's not really a black and white tree right you'd be sure yeah okay so I, like following in a black and white tv show we know there's more to it than yeah. what we see now we apply that to our lives mm -hmm. well, the things we see around us yeah we see them but if we believe what we say we believe then we believe that there's more to it oh absolutely than this and there, there's just so much in our lives like there's times that i'll go to the grocery store and i have a conversation with a guy about sausage yeah. I was at Food Depot and talked to a guy about sausage. Yeah. Like, cool. that could actually be an opportunity by divine appointment set by God for me to introduce him to the gospel. Yeah. There's more to it than season. Yeah. Life. That's a big deal. There are things going on that we do not see. And here, I just thought it was about sausage. It was, yeah. And it's not about just black and white and color TV. Missed it. Next time. Or, yeah, or sausage. All right. Well, I like that verse. It's almost the end of the month. Yeah. Um, can we do something to spice it up? Because we're going to get a new verse soon. I am totally out of games, Corey. I am. Yeah. Ah! I'm kidding. Oh, okay. It's like day 103. You've already run out. Yeah. It's going to be a boring episode 200. <laughs> okay. We played a game once before where we did the memory verse. One word back and forth. It was one word back and forth. Yeah, and we got kind of fast. Uh -huh. But I thought, what if we just said this memory verse as fast as we can? Oh, it's like a tongue twister though, because it repeats a little bit. Yeah, it My is. brain just grinds to a halt. So let's let's start slow. Okay. All right. So faith. Faith is being sure. Am I repeating this? Yeah, you can for is now. Is being sure. That way we can tell them. Okay. You guys repeat it with me. Yeah. Now they, we understand. They probably know it. You already. go from the beginning. Faith. Faith is being sure. Is being sure of what we hope for. Of what we hope for. It's being sure. It's being sure of what we do not. I did the face thing. <laughs> of what we do not. See. See. Or you can just do this. Or combine. Or combine. Yeah. yeah. Or, now you're just getting too Yeah, crazy. that's great. That's crazy. Okay. Faith. Faith. Being sure. It's being sure. Ah! Oh, I messed up. <laughs> Try. Faith. Faith. Being sure. It's being sure. <laughs> I followed right along. <laughs> We're going for speed. We're doing really bad. Yeah. Faith. Faith. It's being sure. It's being sure. What we hope what for. What we hope for. It's being sure. It's being sure. Oh, what we do not. What we do not. See. See. Faith. Oh, Hebrews 11. One. Hebrews 11. One. Nerf. Do we need to throw that at the end? Oh, absolutely. Okay. You gotta make the nerve part loud in case Tucker's sitting in his office. Do you think it. that they can say it faster than we can right now? All right, you ready? <sighs> are we doing it together versus them? You want like to? Like all three or, of us? Or are we all like home? everybody against everybody? I think it's everybody versus everybody because I'm right. gonna beat you. I look at how fast I'm practicing. You are. Okay, ready? Ready? Hold on, hold on. You, you gotta do a countdown. You gotta do a countdown. Are we doing hand motions or can we just say it? You can just say it, but I gotta do hand motions. <laughs> I'm getting good feast. Okay, ready? No, nope, countdown. Two. Do it with us at home. One. Faith is being sure. Oh, you gotta say go. Three, two, go. Faith is being. You gotta do one. <laughs> You're still gonna beat me. You got like six practices in right now. <laughs> Three, two. You know this feels like when you kept interrupting me when I, I do my thing. I know. I know. It's revenge. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. Faith is being sure. You gotta say go. Oh. Three, two, one, go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Faith is being sure of what you hope for, being confident to do what you did I see! I went into the NIV, I didn't do the NIRV. I got good. confused. But did they win or did we win? We won. I didn't win, you won. I didn't they may have beat you without us knowing. I didn't right. say nerve. Three, though. two, one, go. Faith is being sure of what you hope for, it's being confident. I said the confident thing again! It's being sure of what you do not... See, Hebrews 11, one nerf, I beat you. But you know what I can do? <laughs> you didn't finish. That's true. You know what I can do, though? They don't know that I can do this. But I can. I can speed us up saying it. And we can win. Oh, well, let's say it real quick, right now. Ready? Yeah. But we'll do it slow. <laughs> We're going to beat you. Here we go. Right, Three, ready? two, one, go. Faith is being short of what you hope for. It is being short of what you do not see. Hebrews 11, one nerf. Beat you. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be a fun one for you to edit. What do we get to do next? Hmm. We might have some tricks up our sleeves. Okay. Maybe. We don't know. You never know what's coming next. But I know that a video is coming after this. Huh. Well, let's check that out. Yeah.
God, my family really hasn't made a big deal about church and stuff. But this year, I, I don't know why exactly, but all those stories, they came together and I figured out you're real. You're who you say you are. When I started serving at Foster Care Support Foundation, I think I was, I was just trying to be nice. But, but it wasn't. Now it's so much more. It's a way to get to know you better, to serve you better, and to find out more about the people you love, including me. Thanks for making this fate thing easier for me. It's tons easier to believe in what I can't see when I'm doing something I can see. God, you're awesome, amazing. Lots of other words I can't even think of right now. Just thanks. Luke. All right, Corey, I'm here with another game. It's called Look the Other Way. So if I tell you to look that way, you gotta look to the left. If I tell you to look right, you gotta look to the left. Oh, see, I even got myself. So if you if you hear the voice tell you to look left, then you have to do the opposite and you look right. If you tell him, if he says look up, you gotta look down. It's tricky. Let's see if you can do it. All right, Andrew, I am ready to play look the other way. I gotta tell you, uh, it's a simple game, but I'm a little bit nervous about it. Cause I know, like, I, I like to follow the rules. And so when it says look left, I'm gonna wanna look left and I need to look right. Anyway, play along with me. Good luck. We'll see uh, who's better. I, I bet it's going to be you. Here we go. Look the other way. Round one. Right. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Right. Down. Oh, it goes faster? Oh, okay. Down. Right. Up. Down. Up. Right. Right. Left. Down. Left. Up. Right. My brain stalled out there for a second, but I think I still passed round two. Round three, oh my goodness, it's fast. Up, right, down, left, up, down, up, right, down, left, up, right. I messed up one of those, but I caught back on pretty quick. Halfway, oh boy. Left, up, left, right. Up, down, up, down, up, down, left, up. I don't know. I think I'm doing way better at this than I thought I would. Round five, Andrew. Come down, on. right, down, right, down, right, down, right, down, right. I think you were messing with me on that one. Round six. Up, right, down, left, up, down, up, right, down, left, up, right. You messed me up like at least six times on that one. Round seven. Right, up, left, up. Right, down, right, down, left, up, left, right. I did so bad that last round. Oh my goodness. That was a fun game. Good job, Crudication. If you want a good laugh, go back and just watch that last round where my brain completely failed on it. Um, let's play that again. That would be fun. Andrew, great game. Thank you for playing Crudication. It's been awesome. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Bye.